Hello YouTube, welcome back to another review video. Today I would like to review People's Liberation Army Air Force Xi'an Y20 by Panda Models. The mold is beautifully done. The only two flaws are that it lacks three areas on top of the fuselage and there is a big gap between the bottom rudder and the tail cone, in which the gap should be smaller, but besides that, the mold is on point. The colors seem about right, but if you compare it closely, the nose should be a lighter gray and the rest should be a darker gray, but besides that, the print is outstanding. The wing mount is not the best, but neither the worst. There is a small gap in the fore part of the wing mount. I just wish they would have applied some kind of filler so it wouldn't have that gap. The shapes of the wings are nicely done. The engines are suspended on plastic pylons. The shape of the engines look nice. The downside is the color inside the engines are incorrect and the spinners inside the engines are yellow. The landing gear is nice and simple. The wheels roll with the exception of the last set of wheels on each side of the main landing gear. The colors inside of the nose landing gear doors are supposed to be white, but in the model, they are the same color as the fuselage. Overall, it's a beautifully done model and they must have for your collection if you haven't purchased one already. It's a unique piece given the fact that it's a Chinese airplane. Well that concludes the review for People's Liberation Army Air Force Xi'an Y20 by Panda Models. If you have this model, let me know what you think about it in the comment section. Please, like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for the latest reviews. This is Alpha and hope to have you guys back again soon.